Hi guys, in video two, we briefly looked at bars and time signatures. In this video, I'm going to recap and expand on that information. As we discovered, we can divide our stave into smaller portions called bars. We do this by drawing vertical lines called bar lines through all five lines of the stave. Each bar consists of the same number of beats. We indicate how many beats are in a bar by adding a time signature. The most common time signature is 4-4, four, four, and this tells us that we have four equal beats in each bar. If we take a closer look at our time signature, you'll see that it consists of two numbers. The top number tells us how many beats are in the bar, and the bottom number tells us what kind of beat we will count in. If we go back to our note tree, we will see that if we divide our largest note value, the semibrieve, into four equal parts, we get crotchet beats. Therefore, if we have a four as the bottom number of our time signature, we know that we are dealing with crotchet beats. Therefore, a 4-4 four -four time signature tells us that we have four crotchet beats in a bar. We don't necessarily have to stick to using just crotchets in our 4-4 four -four bars, but we must ensure that all the beats we use add up to four crotchet beats. We could combine all four crotchets and write just one semi-breathe, or add two crotchets together to give us a bar of two minims. The four crotchets could be split in half, giving us a bar of eight quavers. We can even use a combination of different note values in a bar. This example, where we have a minim, a crotchet, and two quavers, is one of many combinations of notes that we can use to create a 4-4 bar. The two other time signatures we need to know for this section of work are 2-4 and 3-4. Again, if we analyse these time signatures, we look at the top number to tell us how many beats are in the bar, and the bottom number to tell us what kind of note value we will count in. Both of these new time signatures have the number 4 at the bottom, which tells us that the type of note we will count in is a crotchet. Therefore, a 2-4 time signature tells us that we have got two crotchet beats in a bar, and a 3-4 time signature tells us that we have three crotchet beats in a bar. Again, we don't have to stick to using just crotchets in our bars. We can use any combination of notes, so long as they add up to two crotchet beats in 2-4 time and three crotchet beats in 3-4 time. <laughs>